Hello everybody, getting ready to do lesson 4.4 part 2 today for 6th grade map and then we got 36 points on your class worksheet. Have that out in front of you now students. Part 2, 4.4, solving multi-step problems with fractions and mixed numbers. Students, put your name, date, period here on your paper, on your phone, your tablet, your PC, your iPad your Chromebook. Let's go to page one is a bell work for today. You got a word problem up here for number one. Uh, Jamal hiked on two trails. The first trail was five and one third miles long and the second trail was one and three quarter times as long as the first trail. How many miles did Jamal hike? And then down here you have to solve this uh, sum here and uh, teachers give your students about three minutes three minutes for this uh, these two uh, questions see you in three hello everybody welcome back for today's solutions on today's bell work uh, jamal hiked on two trails how many miles did jamal hike first trail is five and a third second trail was one and three quarter times as long as the first. How many miles did he hike? And it comes out to five and two thirds miles for uh, his total hike. One and three quarters is almost two times that. So you have five plus one and three quarters times that, and it comes out to uh, nine and and. Uh, nine and two thirds so nine and a third miles more than what he did already so add those together you get 14 and two third miles and then solving this sum here three eighths plus two and a half convert this see this would be uh three halves and three eighths so three halves becomes 12 eighths and 13 and three eighths would be 15 eighths so that comes out to uh, see here, wait a minute, 15 eighths, wait a minute, two and a half, oh, see, this would be two, five halves, and then four, so that would be 28, so you have 23rd eighths, is that right, 23rd eighths, and so that come out to two and seven eighths for uh, your sum. Go right into today's classwork here, to divide mixed numbers, write both mixed numbers as find the blank of the divisor and then blank the dividend times the reciprocal of the divisor so here here is your procedure here for dividing mixed numbers write both mixed numbers as fractions so you convert your mixed numbers to an improper fraction then find the reciprocal of the divisor so then you find the reciprocal of the divisor then you multiply the dividend times the reciprocal of the divisor and that will give you your quotient. So moving on now to page two of today's uh, uh, classwork. Uh, there's three stages of problems here of, of solving these problems. We explain, we have answers, and then we use estimating to provide our answers here. So first up here for three quarters, three fourths divided by blank equals three and three quarters. So when we have a uh, division problem here, usually we multiply our quotient times our uh, de, uh, our um, divisor to get our dividend. So in this case here, three and three quarters is actually 15 quarters times something equals three fourths. So to get that, we have uh, uh, 15 fourths X equals three fourths. So when we, div when we multiply the three fourths times the reciprocal of 15 over four, we get four over 15, which would be 12 sixtieths, which is uh, one fifth. So that would be our answer for number one up here. And then th this could be the space here, students, who, that you use on your classwork sheet to do the explanation is to find 
the uh, the divisor of a division problem and we have the quotient and we have the dividend and we multiply our uh, our quotient uh, times our uh, dividend and we get one-fifth and so that would be our answers and we're estimating now by doing this mentally that's basically what we're doing and then down here now we have blank divided by five six now we don't have our dividend we have our divisor and then we have our quotient so to find our uh, dividend we have to multiply five six times uh, one and four fifths which is um, five five plus uh, five times one is five plus four will be nine fifths times five six would be forty five thirtieths 45 thirtieths which would be what one and one half for number two that that's what I'm estimating and so we have one and we have one fifth up here one and one half down here and then students this is for your work to do here teachers you can wait on your students or we can go forward here we have one fifth up here for number one and then we have one and one half here for number two so that's kind of like the mental process that you use you explain what you're doing and then you estimate as you uh, produce an answer does it sound right it seems like it does so that's what we do here on page two eight points for page two and on to another one here page three same kind of format here we have three here two and a half divided by blank equals one and three sevenths so students do that in your head teachers wait on your students and then number four uh, we have blank divided by two and one tenth equals one and two thirds so students at your desk do that teachers wait on your students about a couple minutes and okay let's go with our solutions now for three up here be one and three fourths for our as our um, divisor here uh, and then down here for our dividend we have three and one half for a dividend for number four that is how you would do those in a um, kind of like a mental math kind of format what is the mixed number division problem that these clues describe so here's our clues the sum of the dividend and the divisor is 12 dividend and divisor is 12 the quotient is greater than 3 but less than 4 so it's between 3 and 4 3.5 or something like that and the dividend and the divisor in the fractional part of both quotients are prime numbers so the dividend and the divisor in the fractional part of both whatever fractional part I guess that means what the uh, denominator of both quotients are prime numbers less than 10 so they're less than 10 so those are your clues so uh, teachers again give your students about five minutes to come up with this see you in five okay welcome back everybody for our solution to this like trick problem trick question up here so what we have we have uh, uh, one answer will be uh, the dividend and the divisor in the fractional part of both quotients are prime numbers less than 10 so a sample answer yes would be a nine and one thirds divided by two and two thirds would equal three three and one half so the quotient is uh, greater than three but less than so it's three three and one half and nine and one fifth divided by two and four fifths would equal three and two sevenths both meet the conditions of the clue so you have uh, five would be prime five would be prime three would be prime so that would be the fractional part of uh, what do they see the fractional part the dividend and the divisor in the fractional part of both quotients so the fractional part so you have three and two sevenths and then three and one half so the dividend and the divisor in a fractional part of both quotients are prime numbers less than 10. yeah i mean that could be anything but these two answers meet the uh these two division problems meet the qualifications up here and then nine and one third plus two and two thirds equals 12 so the sum of the dividend and the divisor is 12. so when you add the dividend the dividend up here and the divisor 
you get 12. And then same thing down here, 9 and 1 fifth and 2 and 4 fifths, that would equal 12 as well. So that qualifies there. And then in 1 half and 2 over 7, 1, 2, and 7 are prime numbers less than 10. So that's, that's where they got that from there. So that's kind of like a fun uh, situation there. And that is your lesson for today. Animated PowerPoint Math Video at ALO.com for questions or course materials. Thank you very much.